All new at 6, tough economic time prompting some Valley businesses to not only protect their product, but also their biggest asset, their employees. As ABC 15's Jennifer Parks found out, the threat of workplace violence has more business owners turning to armed security guards. Shooters, unholster your firearm. We're going to be shooting for, uh, for center mass. We don't use these weapons for offense. They're for defense. They are not police officers, but in some cases can shoot just as well. Good shot. These are armed security guards training to be the first and last line of defense. That's a great controversy that's taking place today. Should security be armed or not? Lyle Rapaki is the director of training for Anderson Security Company in Phoenix. He says the current economic climate has businesses wanting to pull the trigger and hire armed guards. About a 33 percent increase in calls uh, on clients, potential clients, asking for uh, armed response. Everything from financial institutions to apartment communities to warehouse jobs, businesses are hot spots for workplace and domestic violence. We have to be ready for anything at any time for any reason. Most of these trained guards have a law enforcement or military background, then go through this 16-hour DPS certified course, including classroom and shooting range instruction. They never want to have to use their weapon, but should they? They want to make sure they're properly trained. Make sure you know that when you discharge it, you're going to take down your assailant. In Phoenix, Jennifer Parks, ABC 15 News.